So today I'm going to be doing a try-on haul with four different products. I'm going to do foundation, um, setting powder, and blush, and then I'm going to do something with my lips and use like a uh, matte lipstick. And so I'm really excited to try these new drugstore makeup out. The first thing that I really wanted to try out is the Dream Cushion um, by Maybelline. I've never really tried a liquid foundation like this before, so I'm really excited to see how it's going to last on my skin and how it looks and stuff like that. This is in medium beige, so hopefully it's the color of my skin. We'll see. And then the next one is going to be a finishing powder, a matte finishing powder by CoverGirl. And this is the color medium beige. I've heard really good reviews on this one, so I'm really excited to try this out and see if it lasts all day. It's supposed to prevent shine for hours and hours, so hopefully it does. And then the next thing is this new blush from Wet n Wild. It's pearlescent pink. It's actually kind of like a coral kind of color. I've never had like a blush like this before, so I'm really excited to try this out on my cheeks. And then the last thing that I will be trying is the Wet n Wild Matte Liquid Lipsticks. I've never really tried liquid lipsticks. I try to stick with the regular lipsticks. And so I'm excited to try these out. I heard good reviews on these as well, especially Wet n Wild products. And so this is in the color Very Recognize super pretty. I like this color a lot. And then the next one is in Coral Corruption, which is also very pretty. So first off, I'm going to try this um, foundation on my face. I actually really like the packaging. I think it's really cute and it's small so we can bring it anywhere with us and like travel with us. It's really nice. So you open this up right here. And it has like a little cushion powder, what are these called? I'm blanking, but anyways, it has one of these. And yeah, it feels very soft. I feel like it would pat really well on my face. So that's kind of cool. And then I just open this up. And has like a little cushion. I think I'm just gonna use this to pat my makeup down and then just like go over it with a beauty blender. little like applicator but I'm not gonna use this because it's yeah. So I'm just gonna use my Sigma brush to just apply this. Just to set my foundation off. The 
one thing I don't really like about this um, packaging is that the mirror is so tiny. Like, there's so, so much room here, and we put a little tiny mirror, and like, I can't even see myself in it. So, don't really like that. I think it's setting super, super well. I really, really like the texture of this. It goes, it goes on super nice. So we'll see what I think about this once it's on for all day. See if it has any shine or how long this is going to last. So far, I'm really liking it. I really like how it applies. I really like how it looks on my face and how there's like preventing it from shining so I'm like that this right here so far and then next up I'm going to be trying the wet and wild blush so that is how it looks I, how do you even apply your makeup with this like it's so freaking tiny this is so cute though so I'm, I'm, I won't be using this. <clears throat> so I'm just gonna put my brush in here. Just apply, and just apply this on my face. very very pretty and it like it's very smooth it doesn't cake or anything like that it's like this is a really good blush for the price it is I think it was like $4.99 so this is a really good blush I really really enjoy it so far so next I'm gonna be using matte lipstick I think I'm going to try on this one. Cute packaging as well. I feel like Wet n Wild has like up their game. It's like a lip gloss applicator. Very, very pigmented and very pretty. I really like that. And it's supposed to be matte, but it's not drying matte right now, so hopefully it will dry matte in a little bit. But like, it feels really nice on my lips right now. It's not feeling like it's dry or like it's it's actually hydrating my lips. So I'm really liking that. 
Alright, so here is my finished little look for today. I will be updating you throughout the day on how I feel about the makeup that's on my face right now. And yeah, so I will see you in a little bit. But before we leave, um, my lipstick is drying and it just feels, it feels like it's getting super, super dry. I don't really like that. I know that matte it's supposed to be like drier because it's matte on your lips but it just feels like it's gonna be very very dry because it's already drying before I'm even done with this video so we'll see how that goes and I'm really not digging this yellow color on my face I wish they had like a larger selection I think they only had like six to eight colors to choose from and like I got another color too I got the color um, caramel that was right next to neon beige and this is really really dark for my skin so like I wish they had like a color in between there because I'm not really digging this yellow color on my face right now but I will update you guys in a little bit also I'll have the products down below and their prices and stuff like that too Okay, so it is about 12.50 now, and I put on this makeup probably at like 10 o'clock, so it's been two-ish, three hours later, and I've noticed that nothing really has changed with my makeup. The blush is still on perfectly, the uh, foundation and... And the pressed powder is on my face perfectly as well. There's no spots on my face that is like spotted with my foundation. Everything is still perfectly on my face. And also I don't have any shine at all right now. So I'm really liking those three items. The one thing that I really don't mind or like is my lips. Like you can totally tell that they're kind of dry and I can feel it too and it might be because my drips my lips are super super dry all the time and stuff like that and it that kind of matted lipstick doesn't go really well with it but I'm not really liking the lipstick so far hopefully it stays like this it doesn't get drier throughout the day so yeah I will update you guys later all right so right now it is five o'clock and I've been noticing some stuff with my face um, first off my lips if you can't tell a lot of it is coming off so I mean for how long it's been on my lips I'm not too surprised so it's actually pretty good and you know how I talked to you guys about how dry it was? It's still kind of dry, but it didn't get any drier or anything. It just stayed the way it was. So I really like that. Like, it's not too dry on my lips. So I like that a lot. Um, I've noticed though for the foundation, um, I notice it's coming off my chin and like this part of my face right here It might be because like when I'm in class I kind of like sit like this or touch my chin a lot So that might be it and then for the powder I've been noticing that I'm getting a little bit of shine like right up here over here like I didn't put any um Highlighter, highlighter on or anything because I just wanted like this new face look and so I think it's been doing fairly well especially for how late it is and how long it's been on my face so yeah I've been really liking it and I will update you probably a f two or three more times before my last evaluation talk to you later Hi guys, so it's 11 o'clock at night right now and you can tell that my makeup is pretty much coming off and stuff already and so which is fine. Um, overall, I actually, I really really like all four products. The one product that I would be like, uh, is with the lip, the Wet n Wild lips. 
um, matte lipstick. But other than that, I really enjoy the uh, the setting powder, the uh, liquid foundation, and the blush. And so, yeah. I'm having a really late night tonight, so I won't be able to get back home to film. Anyways, so thank you guys for watching this video. If you like it, please give it a thumbs up. If you have any comments or anything, just leave them down below about the products and what you think of them. If my um, haul or my try-on haul or my review is maybe off for you or something like that just leave it in the comments down below and then please subscribe down below as well so you get video videos from me once every week and yeah that is all I have for today I will talk to you later